Fisher. The sophomore from Billings West High School set to kick off, and we are underway from Bozeman. Kickoff taken at the 10-yard line by Mark Mariani. Mariani across the 20, has a hole across the 30, forced out of bounds at has time and has Mike Ferreter across the middle. Brought down at the 35 yard line on to attempt about a 50 yard field goal. Carpenter's kick has the leg. Amazing. And he's good. He's amazing, I'm telling you. This kid, what a career. The lone back. And here is Hilliard with a big hole up the middle across midfield. Stutter steps at the 45. Finally brought down at the 30 yard line. David Taylor with the tackle, but Lex Hilliard with a big gain to pick up. Very effectively. Dan Carpenter trying to tack on to his record, and he does. Another field goal, second down from the five. Here's Crawford again, up the middle, touchdown. Third and seven for the Bobcats. Rolovich swings it to Crawford, but he's hit by Quinton Jackson. First and 10 from the 43, here's Crawford again. This time brought down in the backfield by Van Cooper. And the play action to Crawford, Rolovich has time and has a man wide open, caught. If Montana State doesn't get it right here, I'm sure he's got two plays in mind. Crawford. Please. And they say it's a touchdown. Forward progress got him into the end zone by eight points. This is Mike Ferreter. It's just like that. Montana hasn't used it too much today yet. Berquist to throw, has an eternity, and has Mark Mariani across midfield, wrapped up by about half the Bobcat defense. Out of the shotgun. Hilliard picks up the blitz. Berquist has Allen inside the 20. Spinning off tacklers finally brought down. Third and one. Lex Hilliard, touchdown. And they'll go for two, and if you don't get it, it, it puts you kind of behind the eight ball as the game goes along. So I think a good decision uh, of respect there for Montana State's return team. Shows a couple things. You respect that return team, and you also really respect your defense. That's a good point. Coach Out does believe in his guys, and, and he made a comment, as he always does. This has been a second-half team really all year, Phil. They've, they've played well in the second halves of games, just really had good second halves, and they started out in a big way. Colt Anderson with an interception for the Grizzlies, his third pick of the year. But Jack Rolovich, I guess not, no pressure whatsoever. It must have been after the interception, but you know he just must not see Colt Anderson come underneath him. Well, Montana State once again in that 30 front and bring in the pressure. And he has Eric Allen underneath, and Allen is going to cruise into the end zone. Touchdown. Montana State bringing the pressure, but what a great job by Montana. Picking up the twist, picking up the stunt, and uh, I tell you, Kevin Rattoriano right here just kind of gives in a little bit too easily. Eric Allen just cruises into the end zone. Ash talked about at halftime, but they've got to get him going vertically up the field. And on second and 10, Josh Lewis is drilled. And I tell you what, Quentin Jackson is just using the playbook you would expect now to take advantage of that, give him the same look, and then try to go up the field. And for the first time, Montana's going to get home and get a sack. That's Mike Stadnick and Craig Mettler in on the pressure for Montana. Stadnick got there first, two of eight on field goal tries on the season. This one is no good, wide right. Berquist looking, the fade to Ferreter, who makes the grab across midfield, brought down line. Grizzlies out of the eye, fourth and one. Play action, Berquist with time, and has his tight end, Stephen Thaler. Folks, the completion to the tight end Thaler on fourth and one is our momentum plating change of the game, and the ferry to Eric Allen is a touchdown. One guy thought they were in one cover, and the other guy thought the, uh, another coverage, and you can see Eric Allen just gets loose and is wide. Game Demetrius Crawford, over 100 yards rushing on the day in the two touchdowns. Rolovich on third and 15, forced out of the pocket and comes back and has Derek Green. Green with a move, 
And Green went over a lot of room in front of him. And chased down from behind by Croy Bierman. Croy Bierman makes the tackle. Unbelievable. You think you've got... Rolovich goes back here, fires. Mifflin makes a play with his arm. Uh, Green does a nice job stepping underneath, turning this thing upfield, but you can't see it here, but it was an unbelievable. You think you got a foot weight race with your wide receiver and their defensive end. You gotta have a smile on your face until that happens. Inside the one, Isaiah Taito, the deep back dotting the eye for Montana State. And Taito with the carry, dives in the end zone, touchdown. for news and stats on all Grizz Athletics, log on to MontanaGrizzlies.com. The toss to Hilliard. Lowers the shoulder across midfield. Picks up. Hilliard bounces to the outside. Has room and just brought down. Six yards to go. Burquist fires to the outside. Has Mike Ferreter. He turns it upfield. He's field to be effective with. Hilliard on second down. Dives for the end zone. Touchdown touches on what's going to be his first win here in Bozeman. I know that's something that meant a lot to him. He's had a great career, but he is not yet. Uh, now for over a century. Jack Rolovich on first down. Doing a little dance in the pocket, and the little shovel pass is picked off. Troy Beerman comes up field hard. Yes. Rolovich is able to step underneath him, but then he, as he leaves the pocket, Beerman's hot behind him again. He just makes a poor decision here and tries to flip this ball upfield. Really, you're just not going to have any positive results when you try to make a play like that. You talk about Croy Beerman right there, Mike, and that's why he's a Buck Buchanan Award. Uh, really, I think a favorite. You mentioned Lauren Utterback with his second interception of the season. Utterback, a former Class B standout at Fort Benton High School here in Montana. And Lex Hilliard breaking another big run across the 10 into the end zone touchdown number 51 phil for lex number 51 touchdown and you know he kind of puts it into real charisma here enjoy watching him on sundays much more than i ever did on saturday yeah, because I, it's been a little bit quite painful from the blue and gold side with the game he's had the montana grizzlies remain undefeated and win here in bozeman for the first time since bobby Howe took over the job